much, Father. Um, you can please be seated. Good morning, church. Um, it's time for giving and announcements. Uh, but before we jump right into it, I'm just going to quickly share something on giving as an act of worship. And what ha um, has been just coming to my heart is when I'm about to give, is seeing giving as an act of offering. An offering that is a sacrifice to God, a sacrifice that is our worship. John 4 verse 24 says, those that worship God must worship him in spirit and in truth. So if our giving is an act of worship, then it's not something that we can give absent-mindedly. It's not something that we can just do. You know, sometimes when I see that I'm about to give, just because I know the drill, you know, it's time for offering, I just go on my phone. Finance at House of Praise, pa 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 pa, done. You know, dip my hand in my purse and I give. And sometimes the Holy Spirit checks me and He's like, Vera, you've given, but your heart was so far removed from that act of giving. So when we are about to give now, I want us to prepare our hearts. You know, when I think about the Old Testament, whenever they came to offer something to God, it wasn't just something they woke up and they just did. It wasn't a force of habit. There was some kind of preparations that went into it. They'll prepare themselves, they'll prepare the altar, they'll prepare the animal. So now we don't have to do all of that. It's not in our heart. So as we give, let's, let's bring our heart to understand that consciousness, that this is not just a routine. This is not just something, oh, do I have change in my wallet? Let me just throw it in the bag and move on. It's our worship. It's, it's our sacrifice to God. It has meaning. So let our hearts be truly in it. I think of Cain and Abel. You know, there are two parts to giving. There is the giving and the receiving. If I want to give you something, you don't receive it. That act is not complete. So Cain gave, Abel gave. Abel's offering was received. And in Hebrew, we see that Abel, out of faith, he gave. He, out of faith, he gave a meaningful offering. So as we give, out of faith, let us give a meaningful offering. When we understand that this is an act of worship, this is something we do in truth and the spirit, the way we give, the posture of our heart changes. So let's just prepare our hearts, prepare our mind as we give.